Welcome to 5-Minute Chapters, the podcast where we summarize important writings on education and learning. I'm your host, Daniel Bowe, and in today's episode, we'll be discussing how to implement knowledge application lessons from Dr. Robert Marzano's The New Art and Science of Teaching. It's all about engaging students in activities that require them to apply what they've learned in unique situations. So let's dive right in. Knowledge application is about going beyond rote memorization and helping students develop a deep understanding of the concepts they learn. In this chapter, Dr. Marzano emphasizes the importance of engaging students in cognitively complex tasks. These tasks require students to use higher-order thinking skills like analysis, synthesis, and evaluation. They involve activities such as experimental inquiry, problem-solving, decision-making, investigation, and invention. To implement this technique in your classroom, start by designing cognitively complex tasks that align with your learning objectives. For example, if you're teaching a science lesson on the water cycle, you could have students design an experiment to investigate how different factors affect evaporation rates. This task not only requires them to apply their knowledge of the water cycle, but also encourages them to think critically and analyze data. Once you've designed the tasks, it's essential to provide resources and guidance to your students. Anticipate their needs as they progress through the tasks and be ready to offer support at the right time. This support can come in various forms. You can provide informational handouts, teach research skills, conduct interviews, or simply circulate around the room, checking in on students' progress. By providing guidance, you help students navigate the complexities of the task while ensuring they stay on track. Another crucial aspect of knowledge application lessons is helping students generate and defend claims. A claim is something we believe to be true. Supporting it requires providing reasons and evidence. To facilitate this process, introduce the concept of claims and support to your students. Teach them the formal structure of claims and support, and guide them in generating their own claims. Encourage them to provide grounds, which are the reasons behind their claims, and backing, which is the evidence that supports those reasons. Also, help them generate qualifiers, which acknowledge any limitations or alternative perspectives. <clears throat> Remember, there is no strict sequence to implementing these strategies. Observe your students as they engage in their complex tasks and utilize the strategies that best fit their needs. Some students may require more guidance, while others might benefit from more freedom to explore independently. As the teacher, you have the flexibility to adapt your approach based on the needs of individual students, small groups, or the entire class. Implementing knowledge application lessons goes beyond teaching academic content. It's about equipping students with skills that are essential for college and career readiness. Cognitively complex tasks and the ability to generate and defend claims are all part of these crucial skills. By integrating these strategies into your teaching practice, you are not only helping students apply what they've learned, but also fostering critical thinking, problem-solving, and communication skills that will serve them well beyond the classroom. And that brings us to the end of today's episode. We've explored the key strategies for conducting knowledge application lessons from Dr. Marzano's The New Art and Science of Teaching. Remember, it's all about engaging students in cognitively complex tasks providing resources and guidance, and helping them generate and defend claims. Thank you for joining me on 5-Minute Chapters. Be sure to tune in next time for another episode. 5-Minute Chapters, because even teachers need Cliff's Notes sometimes.